Today is Grandma Linda's birthday, so we are going to bake a cake. Sophie is still taking a nap, so we have to be extra quiet because if she wakes up, she's gonna be grumpy the rest of the evening and that's not good. So, let's go make a cake. <laughs> it's time to make dinner. We're having chalupas, so I'm gonna get the meat and beans started. Where's my Sophie? It's perfect the cake. Kay. Once the frosting is on this cake, you can't touch it. You can't like lick it, okay? One, two, three cakes. Yeah, okay, we're gonna Good frost it. Good luck, mommy. Do you wanna taste it? Taste it right here. Oh no, with yeah, your finger. With your finger. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Is it yummy? You can even uh, put your finger on. Do you know who the cake? Grandma Linda's cake. What I should have done is put a dab of frosting on the plate. I forgot. Dang it. On the bottom? Mm -hmm. Can you pick it up? I don't know what you got there. If I pick it up, will it fall apart? Um, no. You want to try it? Yeah. Just lift it a little bit, babe. What's the big red cake? And there is the final. Oh, hello. We got to do the sprinkles, Sophia. Do you ready to put? Are you ready to put some sprinkles on? Mm -hmm. All right. Mm, the bush. We had to put those sprinkles. Which sprinkles, mommy? The sprinkles are over here. Oh, thank you, mommy. Are you enjoying that? Okay. Let's get to it, okay? Well, you know what? We could just do the top. Oh, my goodness. Okay, look. <clears throat> this is what we're going to do. Let's move the frosting out of your way because you're having a little too much fun. Look, Mama's going to get a little bit with her fingers and sprinkle. Can you do that? Good job, baby. Okay, do some more. I love Hummy. You like healthy? More. Yes, a lot more. Kids still made me pickles and grandma grandpa fingers. Yeah. That's like mommy and daddy. That's right. Who is this cake for? Um, for grandma and Linda. Yeah. 
Say happy birthday, Grandma Linda. Yay. You say it. Happy Grandma Linda. Yeah, happy birthday, Grandma Linda. Oh, you're doing a fantastic job, Sophia. Ruben keeps getting ground beef back there. <laughs> <laughs> okay, pumpkin, let's let's rotate the cake. Okay. okay. Oh shoot. Okay, put some sprinkles right there. Oh, sorry. Good job. Okay. All done? Mm -hmm. Can mommy put some more? Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you want to hold the camera for me? Mm -hmm. Okay. I can do my teeth. Yeah. Uh, hold it, okay? Don't drop it. Okay. You're going to do my tongue. Uh. <laughs> how, about, okay. how about you just like smile or something? Okay, okay, okay. What right here? That's just my tongue. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And look at all the sprinkles. Look at all the sprinkles. Whoa. Mommy, can you see that? That's a piece right there. All right, and there is Grandma Linda's cake. Say, we love you, Grandma. We love you, Grandma. Good. We love you, Grandma Linda. Yes, Pumpkin, we do love Grandma Linda. We are having chalupas tonight. Ruben wanted chalupas, so we got chalupas. And here is our ground beef and our beans. Ruben's changing Evan's diaper. That's why he's crying in the background. But, um... And we have some Louisiana sauce. I forgot to get sour cream, so we don't have sour cream. Um, and I think that's the only thing missing. Mm -hmm. Bless okay. us, O oh Lord, for these thy <laughs> gifts which we are about to receive from thy bounty. Through Christ <laughs> our Lord, amen. Amen. Okay, Miranda, you'll get the lights? Yeah. Oh, camera. Not <laughs> Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Grandma Linda. Watch your face, fam. Let's leave it on fire. Okay, Miranda. Okay. No shirt. Ready? Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Grandma Linda. Happy birthday to you. Okay, make a wish for Grandma Linda and blow out the candles. All right. Come on, baby. Come on. Go, go, go. Happy birthday, Grandma Linda! Yes, baby! Oh my god! Happy birthday, Grandma Linda! Yes, baby girl! Okay, move it. Okay, move it. Happy birthday, Grandma Linda! Yes, baby girl! And I do! We need autumn and baby sister. Today marks my mom's, um, what would have been her, what did I say, 63rd birthday, her 63rd birthday. She passed away when she was 55. Uh, for those of you who don't know, she died of stomach and esophageal cancer. It was a very aggressive form of cancer. It, um, it ate her up in, in, in a little over a year. And we just watched my mom kind of wither away and, and stole all the life out of her. Um, my mom was the light of our family. Anything that is good in me came from my mom. And I, I feel sad that um, Amanda and the kids n never got to meet her. Um, she was just the greatest thing. I'm not saying it because she's my mom. She was just, she was just awesome. She was just awesome. Um, 
If you could think of a funny story. A funny story? Or like when you think about your mom and it just cracks you up. My mom, one time she, uh, cause this is my mom. She was, uh, I was still living with my parents and she decided she was gonna do something nice. Like she always did, she always did nice things. She was gonna warm up my car, okay? Cause it was cold. So she did and she backed, she backed it out of the garage. So she started it in the morning? She started in the morning to warm it up. So that way I could go into a warm car that, that I didn't have to wait to warm up. Right. So, um, I, I, I'm getting ready to leave and I go and I notice that the side view mirror is just gone. And, uh, I, I kind of like, I, I look around to see where it's at and it's in the garage. So my mom must have, when she pulled it out, pulled the car out, must have knocked over the side view mirror. <laughs> so, <laughs> I went in there and I was very upset. And I said, Mom, did you not notice that you took off the, the side view mirror? And she, she, <laughs> but, denied it? yeah, flat out <laughs> denied that, that she had anything to do with it. That, that it was just, it was already like that. <laughs> and I was the last one to drive it. So, that's um, cute, baby. that's my mom, you know, and I told you that story. Mm -hmm. And you know, I was so mad that day, but golly, yeah, I wish. If, if she could just be here, she could knock off my side view mirror. Both of, them. Both, of Both them. Both of them, yeah. Give anything to have her back. But. So, I don't know. I, Ruben always gets very emotional. He gets very sad. Because he thinks about his kids and how he wishes that um, she could have met them. But, I don't know. Maybe it's just for my, um, like my own selfish, like just to make me feel better. But I always tell him, because, and I do, I firmly believe it. I don't know how it happens, but, I mean, that's what faith is, right? Faith is something that you believe in. Faith is something that you can't see or necessarily touch or prove, but it's just something you believe in. And so I have strong faith in, I, in, in God, and I firmly believe that somehow, one way or another, Grandma Linda has already met all of her grandkids. Mm -hmm. Um... But I, I, so I think that, I think that before all of her grandbabies were born, she loved on and kissed on and, and met them way before Ruben and I ever did, or, um, his brother Renee and, and his wife Iris ever did. So that gives me peace. Like Grandma Linda knows them better than we probably do because she sees everything. Mm -hmm. But that's again, that's my faith and I, it makes me feel better. And Sophie loves Grandma Linda. We have a picture of her in our bedroom and uh, she's we're just, always telling her. Yeah, we're always yeah. talking about her. She knows that she's uh, with Jesus. Of course, you know, Sophia just turned three. So although I know she doesn't know uh, where Jesus is necessarily um, other than the word heaven, but um, she just knows that Grandma Linda's with Jesus. So she was excited that today was her birthday. I know it sounds uh, cliche, but seriously, if for those of you fortunate enough to still have your mom, tell her you love her every day, hug her, and just uh, whenever she asks you for anything, even if it's like at the most inconvenient time for you, and you have a million things to do, find the time to do it. Because I'd give anything to get one of those calls from my mom bugging me when I have a bazillion things to do that she needs something. So, um, yeah, that's all. That's good. That's a good way to end it. All right, so happy birthday, Grandma Linda. Happy birthday, Mom. That's perfect.